So, um, I haven't posted a video in about a week if you've been keeping up and I've just been doing a lot of thinking. I can explain. So I live alone in a flat with about four people. I think it's four or five. So the thing is, I haven't really met my roommates. Why? Because, well, I just, I'm not a loner, but I haven't really felt the need to. And yeah, now it's like, uh, you know, a few months and it would be very awkward for me to go introduce myself again. So basically, I'm alone. We share a kitchen, yeah, together. But that's it. I have my own room and by myself. And when you're by yourself all the time, it's not a surprise that you might end up, you know, talking to yourself a lot because, well, there is no one there at the end of the day. And then this happened. yeah i cut my hair and it wasn't the intention to leave it on but i didn't finish taking it out so well yeah it's just messed up um i'm gonna try to take the whole thing off and see what i can do with my actual hair i think i might actually cut my hair this is just something else yeah we'll see and i got a new tripod as well this is times two of the other tripod that i have the issue with this is you know it's like uh an attention seeker in public that's gonna be an issue. No door, no day, See, the crazy thing is, when I started off with my first camera, I just wanted a new one after using it for a while because I felt it was time to step up my quality to the next level. And you know, I tried and tried until I was able to get it. And then after that, I wanted this, you know, particular tripod. And then I got it. I wanted this particular light. And then I got it. I wanted this particular accommodation that I live in. And then I got it. You know, like I always strive and keep going for the things that I want. And I don't like to get distracted by little things. I keep thinking, okay, the more camera I get, I get, I'm gonna be happier because I can, you know, make better videos, more videos. But then I finally figured out what the issue was. Why I felt like I needed something to fill a certain part of me. It's because I'm alone. Don't get me wrong, I, I've, you know, always liked being by myself. But that's a different kind of alone. I was never lonely, I was just by myself. But, you know, I, I've literally gone about a year and days, you know, without really seeing certain people that I care about. So go light that cigarette, I hope your lungs can take the heart. And I feel like it's taken a major toll on me and, well, my behavior for the past couple months. <laughs> At every point up until now, I've always just kind of had someone, you know, one person. You know, from secondary school, having a whole family, and I moved uh, back to America, I had you know, um, I had my cousin and, you know, I moved out to school, I had my brother and then I came here and I was supposed to make new friends and stuff but, well, trust I'm not to make friends with anyone. I do talk to people sometimes but at the same time I also withdraw and I don't like to keep people close, to kind of distance myself only because I just feel it's not gonna last very long. Um, I don't know. I said I was gonna document my life every single day and I wanna hold myself to that. And no matter how bad it is or how I feel, I wanna be able to look back and see what it was like in my 19 year old head and brain and how I'm feeling and whatnot. I've been watching Vampire Diaries um, over there for the past week. I'm in season two now. Um, yeah, I've seen it before, but I, it's my favorite show of all time, basically. It takes you like on this roller coaster from like happy to sad to like confused, to, like angry. Like it makes you feel all sorts of things and I love it. So that is what I've been doing and it's helped me, you know, so much to just get my head together. It's like, it reminds me of a lot of things. Whatever Damon's done, whatever's led him here, I'm the one that made him become a vampire in the first place. Current the second released an album and I listened to it yesterday where I only heard like three tracks or so. Um, you should go check it out. It's called Insecure and Vulnerable Green Eyes. Um, I think my favorite still remains Love Bite. Say because I haven't heard everything yet. It's yeah, so also Vibe Soul. He uh, released an EP. So I'm gonna leave the link in the description. I'm alone, so you know, if you're new here, uh, do subscribe, be a friend, <laughs> join the fam, send me a message or whatever. Do remember to turn on my post notifications so I can get notified whenever I upload. And I should be seeing you guys tomorrow and every day after that, but let's not jinx it just yet. Um, I think I'll just show by action. I love you guys for supporting us.
staying we're so close to um, 1,000 subscribers I want to try to take out my hair and uh, see what happens if I have to cut it I'll just I'll just cut it let's hope I don't mess this up this time because you're the next Drew Berry, and I want more and all these other girls keep wanting what I fuck with you for Cause you're the next true Alright, so I'm just gonna just took out my hair And it looks really puffy right now But I know once I wash it, it's like gonna shrink And yeah, I just wanna cut it to a sizable length Because what happened was like when I was trying to snip my hair I snipped the, like a couple in the back, my actual hair So it's pretty uneven So I might as well just cut everything really short um, I really don't know what it's going to look like. I have a very good, so I think I might get my friend to do it um, during the week. So for now, anyway, um, it, don't take any kind of, you know, hair advice from me. I know nothing. Um, I have a lot of nice, you know, natural products that I'm going to put on it right now and um, see how well they work. Yeah, so I'm thinking that when I get blonde braids, I haven't gone to the store yet to see if they have them. So um, the sooner they do, the better. And then I'll just get my hair done. Um... And we'll see how it goes <laughs> yeah one more thing i forgot to record was i was also thinking about you know my life and the direction i wanted to go in and just a lot of things i guess and you know nothing so straightforward sometimes and i'm still you know doing that I try to figure things out and figure myself out i guess you know this is what this year is about for me so i'm alone and not gonna lie it does affect me a lot but i'm just gonna hold off um someone's by the corner and you know i can go home see my friends hopefully or maybe they come to me i don't know but anyway um i think i have a date for valentine's but i'll let you guys know um close to that time or whatever this is not the place <laughs> the next yeah i want more